YouTube, it's Des, and today I'm going to be doing a video on how to find a business space. Um, if you guys have been watching my other videos, I really appreciate it. The first one was how to start a business. The second one was how to fix your credit. The third one was how to save money quickly or fast. And this one is all about how to find a business space. So, um, my business is in a storefront, so it's a little different from those that are online or if you want to market a bit i mean have a business out of your home it can be a little different but when i say how to find a business space first you have to do your research um you have to know what market you're in and if online online right now is probably the biggest you know the greatest way to make money because everything is being done online so if you have a product or if your business could sell online do the research and see um i would most definitely say go ahead and um go online go with the online idea i'm all for it but for me mine is a kids consignment shop princess in the cloth so for me there's no i mean there there's there are ways where i'm selling items online and i do sell you know on facebook marketplace and on craigslist on offer up on ebay i'm on air i'm everywhere but so it does work for me, but with consignment, uh, in order for me to get inventory in, I do have to have like foot traffic. So that's why I had to have an actual space. And um, if you guys don't know, I started off at a very small boutique and over a year I've been able to move into a storefront, which is um, almost a thousand square feet. So I come up in the world and that's because I did my research. So you have to research to make sure um, when you're looking for an area, you have to see if there's a growing area. And the way you can see it, if it's a growing area is by word of mouth. You have to walk around. And what I did was I drove around, took pictures. Um, you want to go in a day and in the night and just to see, you know, the setup of everything. Then you want to go from door to door. If it's, if it's an area where you feel like, first, for me, I wanted to be comfortable so i wanted to be in an area where i felt very very comfortable and where i would be able to market to a certain clientele so i wanted my clientele to be um people who were in the market of you know reselling and consigning so um the area that i'm in it was perfect for that there's a lot of retired uh grandparents in this area and it's very diverse so that alone right there is sold me because a diverse area as well as an area where a lot of like grandparents like our homeowners and stuff I feel like those type of areas are really good for consigning because you know grandmas are gonna always gonna shop for their grandkids and um and when you're talking about a diverse area I feel like that's just an up-and-coming area in itself because you know it's very very hard to find that in a lot of areas so um for me it took me a very long time to find a space but I found it by basically driving by, doing my research, and then the 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 one thing that I didn't do right, well not right, but what I kind of felt like I would have done differently was you know where we drive by, there's like a number. A lot of those numbers go to agents. And for me, I always call all of those numbers, but I wish I would have went directly to the owners of the property. So if you can, if you see a, a space and you're like, oh, I love this space, go to the person next door or the door down and ask them, hey, do you have the number directly to this, um, the owner of the space? Because then you cut the middleman out and you don't have to worry about so much. Now, there are some spaces that will not deal directly with you and you will need an agent. For instance, that was a space that I chose. I needed an agent. So I contacted an agent, um, you know, for this this um, this whole process. And the agent um, is like the middleman. It kind of help you to let you, you know, make sure that your business plan is right, let you know how much money, you know, they think that you're going to need for that area and all of that. So they can be good and it can be kind of bad because they can sometimes work against you in some ways with the agent because they're trying to make money too as well as the person that's moving you in. So they could kind of be in cahoots together. So you got to really, really do your research and really try to find, if you can, um, a space where you can go directly to the owner and don't have to really get that agent. But if you're new like me and you just wanted that extra cushion, that extra security, then an agent is pretty would be pretty good because I'm not going to lie, my agent worked really, really hard for me. He even sat down with me and went through my business plan word for word, you know, everything by the numbers by the graphics just everything so 
that was really really good and if you don't have like a mentor like i didn't per se have a mentor for this he became my mentor so i'm kind of like you know it kind of worked itself out so yeah so if you're looking for um you know actual space then that would be you know the route to go and then if you're looking to like you know work out of your home of course you know that's your home and um you would have to see if it's going to work for your home if you know you have the storage for it if you you know you if you can afford the traffic coming in and out of your house if people you don't know, have to actually come to your house if not then it would be probably best to go either do it online or either you know get a space like hair i know a lot of people do hair out of their homes a lot of people you know save a lot of money by doing hair out of their homes but if you want to be on a bigger scale with a bigger market to people to come to you and actually feel comfortable nowadays because of so much like craziness going on then a space would probably work best for you so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video on how to find a business space the next video will be up very very soon on how to market your brand and your business i hope you guys enjoyed this video until next time youtube bye